damn straight, I'm right. It's fake land, I'm always right. But they're crazy rich. Look, there's new money all over Asia. We got the Beijing billionaires, the Taiwan tycoons, but the Young family, they're old money rich. They had money when they left China in the 1800s, and they went all the way down here. Not there, here. They came to Singapore, when there's nothing but jungle and pig farmers and a snake here eating an apple. You know what I mean? And they built all of this. Now, they're the landlords of the most expensive city in the world. These people are so posh and snobby. They're snotchy. Ew. Yeah, but Nick's not like that. Even if he isn't, I guarantee you the family is. Which is why tonight, you need to not look like Sebastian of the Little Mermaid. You know, the little crab guy? Look at this guy, he's sleeping. Come on, this isn't your grandma's, bro. God damn it. Thank you for driving me. Duh, it's like my one chance to see the young family mansion. Mm. Rachel! Oh, uh, this is my friend, Caitlin. Hi there. Howdy! Thank you very much for bringing Rachel. Oh, no worries. Do you want to stop by for some dinner? Oh, no, I couldn't impose. No, it's not a problem. You know, I had some dinner Seriously, plans. Seriously, Yeah, I'll fucking come to dinner. Nope. You have a cocktail dress in your trunk? I'm not an animal, Rachel. People like your dress. Oh, I did that. Oh. I know. Such a chic 70s goddess. I know. It's very disco Cleopatra, but in a good way. That's exactly what I was going for. Oh, well. Oliver. Hi. I like your shoes. Oh, thank you. I'm Peg Glenn. Yeah. 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 These are lovely. They're clip-ons, thank you. Are they? <laughs> you know, I bet if you told her you'd leave Nick for like a million dollars, she would write that check. They do that around here. She looked at me like I was nothing. Like a $10 million check. I, I feel like she would do that. I don't even know what I should do. I mean, I can't even tell Nick because he like worships her. Yeah. Chinese sons think their mom's Fart Chanel number five. That's bullshit. You're just scared. I'm not. OK. Here's what you need to understand, all right? It's not about getting Eleanor to like you. It's about getting her to respect you, all mm. right? Right now, she just thinks you're some, like, undeserving, clueless, gold-digging, okay, trashy, unrefined banana. Yellow on the outside, a white on the inside. I know what a banana is. When in reality, you're like a super sophisticated, smart professor of freaking game theory. Show her that side of you, you know? Yeah, she's like trying to play a game of chicken with me. Where she's like coming at me and like thinking I'm gonna swerve like a chicken. But you can't swerve. I'm not gonna swerve, not for her. No, chickens are bitches, dude. And I'm not a chicken. You're not a chicken. You gonna roll up to that way and you gonna be like, bok, bok, bitch. Bok, bok, bitch. Chickens are bitches. <laughs> Sorry. I'm going portfolio. You have no one, no net worth. But you have integrity. That's why I respect you. Thank you for everything.